We saw in both special education and in healthcare, when you do measurement and objective goals and then invest in people and training and development, you get better outcomes. So I've always been intrigued with this in, in communities. One of the big things we you've got to have is you've got to have the measurement. And just think about it. If you were driving a car, isn't a dashboard pretty important? I mean, I went across the bridge today and I looked at the dashboard quite often because I'd gotten a speeding ticket one time on, on the bridge in a car. I didn't even know it went that fast. Can you imagine if you're in a plane and you had no instrumentation? We fly communities either with no instrumentation or we don't want to believe it. So we got to have measurement. And that measurement has to be transparent. Our dashboard's going to be up. It's going to be updated. We're not saying it's good, bad, or indifferent, but we'll tell you. We'll tell you if our crime rate is better than it should be or worse based on statistics, if our education is better or worse, if our wages are better or worse. It's out there. I think we all face problems in, in every community, and I always say when somebody sees a problem and they have a solution, they have a human responsibility to bring that solution. And I guess that's what we're trying to do because we all are here for one reason, and that's to improve the quality of life for people.